Food Finder serves a 16 county service area, so it's about 6,500 square miles across north central Indiana, and it's our job to make sure that all of our food pantry partners and the food insecure folks in those, in those communities have access to enough food. In our service area, we know that there are nearly 80,000 individuals who are considered food insecure, and of that number, about 23,000 are children under the age of 18. Food Finders is striving towards, you know, always serve the, that immediate need, but we're always looking to the future and, and trying to get to the root cause of why people might be food insecure. Food Finders has recently adopted a new motto, which is solving hunger today, ending hunger tomorrow. And we like that phrase because what we're trying to let people know is that we are meeting immediate food needs for people, and that's what we consider to be solving hunger today. But our goal, our long-term goal, is really to help people become self-sufficient, and that's where we talk about ending hunger tomorrow. We have a lot of programs with that goal in mind. We believe that people need to be educated about um, using their food resources wisely, about tenant rights, about other forms of assistance like heating assistance or childcare or medical insurance. So we want people to be able to access all the things they need to get their life in order so that they can um, meet their own food needs and hopefully become employed. Solving Hunger Today incorporates all the programs that are addressing the needs that are immediate. We're planning whether it's direct assistance to somebody who needs it that exact moment and that exact day or planning for, um, for instance, our backpack program gives food to kids for the weekend when they're not in school. We currently have over 72 sites um, in all of our counties um, and that serves about 2,700 children throughout the service area. Our agency partner program consists of all the soup kitchens, all the food pantries, and all the shelters that um, utilize food finders to get the food for their um, programs on their sites. We currently have 120 active agencies across all of our 16 counties. We act as sort of a uh, food sourcing unit for them to get their food for whatever activities they're utilizing the food for. Where we have classes on all sorts of things from meal planning and meal budgeting to stress reduction to writing a cover letter and a resume. So all kinds of classes that we offer to people. We also also encourage everyone to sign up for all of the federal benefits that they're eligible for, in particular SNAP, which is what used to be called food stamps. So the J.P. Lysak Community Food Pantry opened in 2016. We offer a no barriers atmosphere downstairs so clients can come in and, and do the bare minimum as far as just providing us their name and address and then we allow them to go through uh, downstairs and get the food that we have. We see anywhere between 250 to 300 clients but we've seen a jump this past year to uh, anywhere between 350 to 400 clients. Uh, so the mobile pantry program is designed to be a supplemental resource to uh, our clients in more of our rural areas. So we take our truck out into underserved areas. The truck serves about 150 clients. It has about 5,000 pounds of food on there. So a lot of times people think that Food Finders is probably funded by the government because we are providing such a basic need for people, food. But in fact, we get very little government funding and it's all um, donations from businesses and individuals and foundations that enable us to do as much as we're doing. So Everyone always asks us what they can do to help, and the top three things we need are donations, volunteering, and advocacy. For every one dollar that's provided to Food Finders, we can turn that into three meals. Or another way to look at it is that 94 cents of every dollar goes directly towards food and programs. So we're very efficient and we make sure that we do the most with our donor dollars. Volunteering is huge. We have something for everyone. We have projects if you like working with people or if you'd like to do something behind the scenes. The great thing about volunteering here is knowing that you have an immediate impact in the food that you're touching or sorting through or working with is going out the next day to people in need. We are also always looking for hunger advocates and it's as simple as helping us um, you know share our message on Facebook or on Twitter and Instagram, following us, keeping in the loop, keeping updated on hunger statistics and things like that, getting to know what we're doing and, and being a voice in our community to let your friends and family and your circle of influence know how important it is to fight hunger.